Hey, good morning. Uh, today, 444, it is going to be the nicest day of the week, of the weekend, of next week. <laughs> Not looking too particularly good. All right, I hear you. <laughs> but look at the beautiful skyline this morning. Isn't that picture? I love it. Isn't that nice? Torrington, good morning to you. you got a mixture of sun and clouds out there this morning. The sun is up in just about a half an hour, 30 minutes, one of the longest days of the Look at Old Saybrook. Hello. Hello, Mariner out there. Isn't that, isn't that very nice? Absolutely. It's the solstice. Oh, my goodness gracious. Look at Hartford. Oh, my gosh. Isn't that beautiful? It's gorgeous. Obrigado. Hartford, absolutely gorgeous. Look, oh, wow. look at stores, too. Look, wow. it's absolutely amazing and mystic this morning. Everything is alive with color. The grass is green, although we could use a little rain around here. Temperatures this morning, a little shy of the normal. 59 is the typical overnight low. We've got that for you at Bradley and in Brainerd and in New Haven and in Bridgeport, but just a degree or two shy in Salisbury, Torrington, Waterbury at 56. You've got 53, though, in Putnam. Got an email from Eleanor in Hampton. She's got 51 this morning. Woo! 53 in Willimantic. So I don't know. You don't need a jacket or a sweatshirt out there. We're down, though, from where we were 24 hours ago, anywhere from 1 to 5 degrees cooler. The winds will be out of the south and east today. Right now, they're out of the north, anywhere from 3 to 5 to 8 miles an hour. The wind is not an issue, nor will it be during the day today. And the dew points are very comfortable in the mid-50s. And that puts us in the pleasant category once again. So that's some good news. And it'll stay that way all day today. But... I want you to notice one thing, dew point trend, not going down. It's comfortable today, fairly comfortable tomorrow, but then Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, it starts to spike, getting near the oppressive level. So it is going to be quite, quite, quite uh, muggy, if not downright oppressive, okay? So just keep that in mind. Wind trend today is out of the south and east. Even some due easterly winds, which is going to keep the shoreline temperatures a little bit cooler. We're only going to be in the upper 60s. Upper 60s on the first day of summer, low 70s for the immediate shoreline. And the wind will pick up a little bit today, 10 to 15 miles an hour for the shoreline. So it's going to be a bit breezier along the shoreline than in inland Connecticut. Satellite and radar, there's really not a lot going on out there right now. High pressure is in control, but you're going to notice some rain. It is to the south of Connecticut, and that rain will be here by tomorrow morning. I'm hoping that they'll be able to get their games off. I know they start real early tomorrow morning at the Travelers Championship, but watch what happens. This is 6 p.m., a little bit of an increase in clouds for the shoreline, and then here comes this rain again. It's falling on my head like a memory. If you want to dive into the ocean, it's raining there, too. So, baby, talk to me. Uh, 2 a.m., very early in the morning. It's raining in Fairfield County. Here comes the rain for the shoreline. This is 5 a.m. This is 9 a.m. That's not looking too good, right? So we're going to keep you posted. Then that kind of pushes up to the north. The rest of the day should be fine with an occasional passing shower, maybe a brief thunderstorm. But tomorrow morning is looking a little bit wet. All right, daytime highs today with partly sunny skies. Temperatures topping out in the mid to upper 70s, cooler along the shoreline. And then the next seven days... Womp, womp, womp. Uh, we're talking about showers and thunderstorms each day with temperatures that are going to get warm and it's going to get muggy around here for Saturday and Sunday. Not a washout, but there will be scattered showers and thunderstorms around from time to time.